It is the most expensive Big Mac I've ever had. Let's see what's inside the Happy Meal. As for one ketchup, it's 30 cents. here in Zurich, Switzerland and today we're going to visit the most expensive McDonald's in the world. That's right. Zurich is known to be a very very pricey place not just for McDonald's but in general cost of living here is a little higher than everywhere else in the world. I think it ranks up there if it's not the most right now it's with Japan and places like Dubai and Singapore, Hong Kong. We're gonna check out the McDonald's. As you know, we've visited a lot of McDonald's around the world, including in Poland, in Germany, in Mexico. Yeah, all over. <laughs> all over, so we wanna see what it's all about, the differences, the similarities, the quality. And let's see what the kind of items they have, right? Yeah. Maybe they have some things Variations, and... yep, exactly. And of course, the price. The price, yes. So let's go inside yeah, let's and check go. it out. Hopefully we don't go too broke on this uh, adventure. So. Okay, so we have the menu board as usual where you can tap the screen. All right, so we're gonna eat here. So we have all the stuff here on the side. Beef, chicken, veggies and fish. Happy Meal, gluten-free snacks and fries, Big Bang. So let's look at the beef first. Double Big Mac. Right now, I think it's like a dollar and four US to one Swiss franc as of today. So it's about one to one almost. $9.30 for a double Big Mac, Six eighty dollars for a regular Big Mac. Royal variations, big and tasty, single or double, small burgers, fan burger. Okay, so we know what these are. Let's look at the royal variation. Holy cow. Oh my god, these are expensive. Royal crispy onions and bacon. Cheeseburger royal. Double cheeseburger royal. I definitely want to get a Big Mac because I want to try it. I heard that the food here is better quality. So we'll do a Big Mac. Let's do a meal. $13.60. How much is it in the US? Like something like that? Maybe Big like Mac? six or seven bucks. Should we do, yeah, medium fries. Okay, so sauces, barbecue ketchup, potato sauce, cocktail sauce, hummus fritters sauce, sweet and sour, curry sauce, mustard sauce, hot devil sauce. So we do the curry sauce? Yeah, why not? And then you get a drink. So they have Coke Zero, regular Coke, Fanta Zero, the Big Mac fries, curry sauce, and Coke Zero. Add to order. Okay, let's see what chicken options here. Homestyle crispy chicken variations, McChicken, spicy McChicken, that's $6.30. Chicken paprika, spicy nuggets, chicken tenders, McNuggets fan burger chicken. Let's go back here. Let's see the veggie yeah. ones. I will do the spicy McVeggie. Let's see the gluten free hamburger, no gluten. Cheeseburger, no gluten. Double cheeseburger, no gluten. Double cheeseburger, bacon, no gluten. Okay, we have to do a cheeseburger, no gluten. I want to try really? it. Three dollars and forty cents. It's three dollar forty cents cheeseburger. Snacks and fries. So you can get tenders, nuggets. Look at the snacks. Okay, so why don't we get the dime donut, and then I'm gonna get the other McFlurry, the Toblerone one. Wait, I want to see the kids menu. Oh, they have a four piece, no gluten, <laughs> so your kids can have a gluten free you get lifestyle. Like a, still like a toy or something. Mm. Yeah, so let's get the nuggets yeah, okay. with the carrot flour. <laughs> so it's a lot for the Happy Meal, but it's $7.20. Okay, let's add that. Wow, I used the total one out of shock. Complete? Are we doing this? Actually, no, we need to remove one McFlurry. Okay, so that's the Big Mac meal. Spicy McVeggie, cheeseburger, no gluten. We're gonna remove this one, right? Because we got the dime donut instead. Flurry, Toblerone, and then the Happy Meal. 37, that's a commendable amount, let's say. For the most expensive, proceed to checkout. Oh, they give you the option to get it later. I wonder if you have this back home. I know we don't go to McDonald's often, so it might be something that's already there. Big Mac meal, curry sauce, spicy McVeggie, one cheeseburger, no gluten, the donut, Toblerone, nuggets, Happy Meal, and a donut. Wow, 3870. And there's a 7.7% tax. Probably like 40, a little over 40, maybe. Oh my god. So this ketchup here, as for one ketchup, it's 30 cents. So when we complain about sauces being extra in the US, just think of a 30 cent packet of ketchup. Okay, so I have the 14 Swiss franc Big Mac meal with the 
half liter Coke, zero, medium fries, and the Big Mac. It is the most expensive Big Mac I've ever had. Okay, two patties, pickles, lettuce, sesame seed bun, and cheese. It's not much to explain, it's a Big Mac, so I'm gonna dig in. So I wanted to eat it in the classic way, but I like to, usually I eat the sesame seed bun face down, so I will take another bite, you want to see that. It's a little bit messy, but it is really good. It's more messy, more expensive, but it's not bad. Like I said though, the price, I knew what we were getting into here, it's exactly the same. The lettuce and everything is all outside too, so it's exactly the same. I don't know if I'd come here to eat a $14 Big Mac meal. If you're craving McDonald's, it's not bad. Gosh, that's expensive. So I have the veggie spicy mac right here. So nice that they have like some vegetarian options. Let's see how it looks like. See if it's some better quality. It has like a nicely roasted bun. It looks like a mac sauce. So I will break off like a little piece and try how the fake meat tastes like. That looks interesting. Mm, it's pretty good, yeah. So this actually reminds me of the KFC chicken McNuggets the, from Beyond Meat. It tastes really similar. So I will just take a nice bite of it, see how that expensive veggie mac tastes. Mm, wow, I actually like it. Because the bun is really crispy and also the, the fake chicken burger is really crispy. I like it. I know it comes with a <laughs> hefty price tag, but it tastes really good actually. For a burger from McDonald's, I'm, I'm impressed. I actually, I really, really like it. But I know it's a very expensive veggie burger. Okay, so I got my gluten-free cheeseburger. Oh, so this is neat. The bun looks super artisanal. Look at that. That's different for sure. Cheeseburger, these were 39 cents growing up on a Wednesday, $3.40 now. <laughs> a lot of ketchup. Mm. It's gluten free, so I'll give it a pass, but not really like it's missing the chewiness. In fact, the bun is just missing that softness, you know? Health wise, it's good. Taste. It's a niche niche. <laughs> And then I, we also ordered the Happy Meal. I wanted to see how it is here in Switzerland. Let's see what's inside the Happy Meal. It's a Pokemon. What? What is it? I have to unpack it. How exciting. Oh, it's like a Pokemon game. Oh my god. Oh, and it's cards with Pikachu. That's cool. So of course it's all in German. It's a nice little souvenir. <laughs> oh, it's a $7 Happy Meal. So you, But you get a little toy. Then you also get, of course, you get the, the meat, it's a chicken McNugget, so Sean will try that because as you guys know I don't eat meat. It also comes with the carrots, which is nice, you know, like it's a healthy option. And then it also comes with, what is this? Oh, it's a fruit, it's a fruit puree, 100% made of fruits, so also healthy or healthier. It even says without extra added sugar. So this expensive Happy Meal comes with carrots chicken mcnuggets fruit puree and of course a little toy not a bad deal okay so i'm gonna try the mcnuggets that came with the happy meal it's a four piece they look the same and i did get the curry sauce as well as pommes frites sauce pommes frites is german for french fries french. so let's try pommes frites sauce right here looks like a mayo honestly with some spices or something in there and then i'm also gonna get the ketchup which we paid 30 cents for 30 cents can't get over that that's crazy you know we just give it out like candy when you ask them for McDonald's ketchup. So that's the curry sauce here. That's the nuggets, they look exactly the same. So curry sauce, it's very popular in, in Germany, especially curry wurst, right? So this is just a little variation that brings a little bit of the, the German influence to McDonald's. Mmm, it really has a nice sweet curry flavor taste to it. This would do well in the US. I wanna try it by itself. The nuggets do taste better. Now I want to try the pommes frites. Tastes like, almost like tartar sauce, but it's good. It is good. I want to try the carrots. They are pretty. Carrot and bloomin look like flowers. They are just great. They're sweet, but I don't, you know, they're cut nicely and they're healthy. And you gotta fry. <laughs> okay, and this one looks like apple, pear, and banana. You gotta know. I think it's like an apple sauce kind of consistency, I guess. 
Oh yeah, it's got like a pear. You know how pears, when you bite into it, that, that consistency, that's what this has. Definitely. Okay, so lastly I have a dime donut here as my dessert. It comes with almonds and milk chocolate and it's a Swedish Norwegian milk chocolate bar. Let's give it a try. And here you can even see a dime. Let's bite into it. Mm, it's really nice and crunchy. And the milk chocolate is really nice, oh my god. Mm, it's a nice donut. According to Sean, dime is not really known in the US. I, I wasn't even aware of that because here in Europe it's kind of a standard <laughs> milk chocolate bar. It's really good though. Dime. So we just got our food from McDonald's and finishing up with the McFlurry which we ordered to have a little later. There was a little mix up, I guess maybe we took a little while to get yeah, it. Yeah, maybe we ate but too But she slow. pointed to the to the receipt and was like, oh, it's this time. We got the McFlurry after Sandy did some talking and... What was it, McFlurry? Um, with Toblerone. Toblerone. So it's a chocolate from Switzerland that Americans will definitely know. How much was the McFlurry? I think it was $3.90. The ice cream machine does work, which I like. <laughs> Two, they have wooden spoons. I just noticed oh, that. Yeah. It's a wooden spoon. It's more health and health, more environmentally friendly. friendly. Yep. Yes. So let's try it. You can see the Toblerone bits. Oh yeah, it's good. They don't mix it too much though, but it is. I think it's more of like a ice cream with a topping. Was I have good. brain freeze. Yeah. Cold. <laughs> I'm having brain freeze right now. McDonald's in Switzerland most was, expensive the thing is yeah it's so expensive <laughs> you would expect something like way a little greater, bit more premium way, yeah, yeah. way pre more premium than in the u.s mm -hmm. but it's not the case i would say yeah it's, like, it, it's almost like the u.s yeah for the most the part same, yeah. and i even was thinking you know they use premium beef or like something australia like that, and i really. honestly it tastes the same yeah. lettuce My, is all normal the like only it, thing in the is US. My, the, my veggie mac that was pretty good yes and it I, had I a bite to it too yes. like a spice like a nice spice to it yeah. and um, that you don't you cannot find in the u.s you can get McDonald's. the hot and spicy with chicken but not i mean for vegetarians yeah. you so know? maybe sometime in the near future that'll maybe go to the u.s but yeah. that was a that was a good burger yeah. for sure but I yeah agree. the pricing is outrageous oh yeah <laughs> that's that's like a 40 dollar mcdonald's meal just now i mean the ketchup was 30 cents <laughs> Swiss French. Thanks for, yeah. So come to Switzerland, think twice if you want to have McDonald's. And the one thing I was going to say, the gluten-free burgers, unless you really, really, really cannot have gluten, skip the gluten-free burgers. They're, uh, it's, no. Yeah, it's still bad anyways. Yeah. You know? I mean, it's not healthy food. Let us know what you think down below in the comments. Drop a like if you enjoyed this one. You know McDonald's videos are our forte and we love doing them and just learning about the differences and also one pricing. thing we did talk about, the pricing really gives you an idea of what you're going to expect to pay in a country in yes, general. It's really like, it shows you like how much. They call it the Big Mac index. Yeah. You know, and yeah. the, the most it's expensive true. Big it's Macs. Really yeah. So, I mean, if things you want to get a feeling for how expensive a country is compared go to, the to McDonald's. your local McDonald's, and yeah. then you will get an idea. You'll get an idea and know exactly what you're stepping into. Yeah. So, cool. we'll okay. see you on the next one, all right? Bye. Bye.